That now to overnight news. The state's appeal to bring masks back to Illinois schools gets dismissed. Yeah, CBS 2's Marissa Parra has been covering this story for almost two weeks now, and she's on the way to District 300 in Algonquin. She joined us on the phone. Marissa, this is another legal blow for the governor. It really is. And one thing I will say, we are on our way. Please take it very, very slow if you're in these more rural areas because we're basically driving on a sheet of ice right now. It's not good in some of these areas, so please be careful. Okay, so back to our story for this morning. We have described this fight as legal whiplash. In its latest turn, the appellate court dismissed Governor Pritzker's appeal, calling this a moot issue. That's a direct quote. Now, this comes just days after a bipartisan committee had failed to move this forward by voting not to reinstate the emergency mask rule. In the days that followed, the governor insisted that it was too soon for schools and that students should continue to mask up. The appellate opinion, posted late last night, says in part, quote, an issue is moot where an actual controversy no longer exists between the parties or where events have occurred that make it impossible for the court to grant effective relief. Now, last week we saw protests across districts like the one in Algonquin asking for mask options. A few days ago, District 300 had said... They would phase in the mask option, but they didn't want to set a date. So with this overnight news, it'll be interesting to see if anything changes with school districts like District 300. We're live from Algonquin on the phone on our way to District 300. Marissa Parra, CBS 2 News. Well, no matter the way you get it to us, Marissa, we appreciate that information. Very important for so many students and families across our area.